Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Angie Walker. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, January 6th, 2022. Now it's time to take a brain break. Let's check in with Scott for today's sports highlights. Thanks, Angeli. Sports fans, the astonishing Tom Stoltman was declared the world's strongest man after picking up a stone that weighed 463 pounds, which, if you didn't know, is heavier than a piano. His competitive older brother, Luke, challenged Tom to see who could pick up more weight. Even though Tom was tall and skinny, had no confidence, and didn't like going to the gym, his brother pushed him to never give up and keep trying. Ten years later, he credited his win on his autism, which gave him a daily routine and helped him to focus. Our 400-pound real-life Superman proves again that with discipline, we can achieve anything that we put our minds to. Now let's go to Valencia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is sloppy joe, bun, baked beans, dried cranberries, and your choice of milk. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Angeli. Thank you, Valencia. Our March I Ready Challenge started on January 3rd and ends on March 16th. Students must have 25 past math and I Ready lessons to go to the glow party. Let's get our lessons done and glow crazy for the next challenge. The I Ready assessments are here. The second one is today and tomorrow. It's for grades K through 2nd in ELA, and the next one is next week, Tuesday and Wednesday, for grades 3rd to 8th. Take a look at the flyer for more upcoming dates. Make sure to use your test-taking strategies. Our Pines Patriots Car Wash is coming up. It's on Saturday, January 29th, from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. It costs just $10 per car wash. Tickets are sold on myschoolbox.com. This event is to support our athletes, so let's get those cars sparkly clean. Now, let's go to see what the was going to be like today with Randy. Thanks, Angeli. Hey, Patriots. Looks like today's weather is 81 degrees Fahrenheit and partly cloudy. Winter has come to an end, so no more cool and chilly weather. In other weather news, Mars has a canyon called Valles Marineris Canyon, and it is filled with tons of water. This is surprisingly fascinating because Mars can be a hot planet reaching up to 235 Fahrenheit. The water freezes up and unfreezes. This could make the canyon deeper each time it goes through that phase. This information can lead us to our goals or help us one day terraform Mars. Now let's go to Destiny for the birthdays. Thank you, Randy. Today's birthday boys and girls are Cameron Corporal, Peyton Corporal, Gabrielle Lamaz, and Ben Trevino. Happy birthday! Now let's go to Vani for Patriot on the Go. Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Patriot on the Go. I'm Vani Osain. Now let's hear Patriots' answers to our question: What subject would you add to school? I have a question for you. Yes. What's one subject you would add to school? I would add driving to school. And why is that? Because everybody deserves to be like Stephen Curry and LeBron James. Oh, cool. Okay, let's see our next one. What subject would you add to school? Thank you, sir. Classes. Baking soda classes? Yes. Why is that? Because it's fun and I like to um, make my baking soda. Okay, well, let's see your next Patriot. Okay. Hey, excuse me, do you want to get interviewed? Yes. Well, I have a question for you. What is one subject you would add to school? I will add PC and gaming for and fun games. And why is that? Because everybody likes to play. Oh, cool. Yeah, I see that. 
Well, let's see our next Patriot. If you can add one subject to school, what would it be? Um, another science classes. Another science class? And why yeah. is that? Because uh, we only have biology in this school in eighth grade. So I would just think we could learn more subjects for science, not only biology, <laughs> when we go to high school. Oh, cool. Question for you. What's one subject you would add to school? Swimming class, because I like swimming. Oh, cool. Is that the only reason? Yes. Okay, well, let's see our next Patriot. What is one subject you would add to school? I'd add coding because it allows students to go to very prestigious schools and also allows them pr to pursue their dreams like gaming. Oh, that's cool. Okay, let's see our next Patriot. What subject would you add to school? Um, probably one of my favorites, which is cooking. I love cooking. <laughs> oh, cool. Those are some very interesting answers, Patriots. See you next time on Patriot on the Go. I'm Bonnie Osine. Bye. Thank you, Bonnie. Patriots, here are your past expectations. They represent, present yourself positively, act clients with others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Now for yesterday's trivia winners. Congrats to Ms. June and Ms. Onley. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, what planet is home to Chewbacca and the Wookiees in Star Wars? The correct answer is Kashaki. Now, teachers and scholars, here's today's trivia question. Who is known as the King of Pop? Teachers, please send your answers to finds.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday. And don't forget, this year we're all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day!